Hello, I'm Nicholas Woolwork. Um, I want to try and help you make less mistakes than me through my journey. People say, how do I start in property? I've got no money. I've got no savings. I haven't got a deposit. You know, in this day and age, the prices of property are so high. How can I possibly afford to get into property and start building a successful portfolio like you? Um, and I, you know, I merely say to them, you, you can use other people's money. You don't need to have a ton of money in the bank to get going. What you need is the desire, the drive, and the knowledge to start doing it. So other people's money, it can come from joint ventures. So you might have the bank of mum and dad say, look, mum, dad, I need 30 grand to buy this property and I'm gonna do this with it and it's gonna make money. Mum and dad might be very friendly and give you an extremely low interest rate or zero interest rate. So yeah, that might be great for the first property, but that's not scalable either. But you might borrow that money and say, well, I'm gonna give you a good interest rate. I'm gonna give you, you know, five or 6% to mum and dad, which is more than perhaps the mortgage on their house costs. So one option would be for them to refinance some of their home, take out a bit of cash for you to use as your deposit, maybe cost them three or 4% on their mortgage. Maybe you could give them five or 6% return from your income from the property you bought. So that's a great way of kind of getting going. If you've got family that own a property, you know, not everyone does, so that's not for everyone, but it's certainly a good option to get started if your, your parents are, uh, you know, trusting enough. When I realized how to use other people's money, I sourced cracking deals. So I created cracking deals and then people wanted to buy them. So I was like, well, why, why do I want that person to go and earn a hundred thousand pounds on this deal? Um, and I'm only earning a few thousand pounds selling them the lead. Well, I need to find someone that wants to maybe share that hundred thousand pounds and take 50,000 um, and I can take 50,000. So that's where a joint venture partner um, or, or an, another form of investor or an equity investor that has a ton of money and perhaps not the time to invest in property. That's someone that is your best friend right now. It's someone that you can help them. You know, if you take the approach of helping other people uh, you know, it's not just a selfish, I want to make money, I want to get into property for myself. You know, you need to have the ethics and mindset to want to help other people, creating safe and sensibly and affordable homes for tenants to live in. That's a great goal to have as part of building a portfolio, as is helping anyone that works with you. So the private investors and the JV partners, um, ensuring the banks are happy, you know, they are only lending you money to get an interest rate return. And you want to give them a secure deal and you want them to lend to you again. So performing and having a good deal is the starting point for all of that um, and delivering on your promises that you will make them money. You're gonna help other people make money. If you can create a win-win relationship, you can create a cracking deal that creates that relationship for yourself, for the investor or the lender, and for your customer, who is ultimately your tenants who live there. If you can create that combination, you're onto a good thing. And that's the fundamentals that I've used for my property investment journey. It served me well. I wish I had learned that in the early days um, because I'd have scaled up quicker and earlier. But you know what? There's nothing wrong with learning the hard way. Um, I just don't want you to learn quite that hard a way. So good luck on your own journey. If that video has whetted your appetite and you want to get some more knowledge, then click either one of the videos right here, right now, and you can get some more information on growing your property portfolio. So what are you waiting for? Click right now. Did they click yet? Not sure. What are you waiting for? Come on. Click either one of these videos right now.